Luis Engargiola, shares of Magnagas have been on a wild ride this year from two to seven. Now they're around 270. Mm -hmm. So what is the energy technology that has the stock so energized? Well, we have a technology that we believe is unique to the industry. Uh, it converts liquid waste into a hydrogen-based fuel. It works on the basis of a plasma system. It's uh, very compact. It fits in a 200 square foot area. And with a very small amount of energy, we're able to convert various li liquid waste like oil, um, antifreeze, sewage sludge manures into this hydrogen-based fuel that we're selling in the industrial gas market. And how does the, the price of your energy compare to natural gas? We keep hearing about fracking and oil and coal. Is it cheaper? Well, yes, it is cheaper. Uh, we are focused, there's several different uses for our gas from the industrial side, for example, metalworking in replacement of acetylene to uh, direct replacement for natural gas. Our current market is actually a replacement of acetylene. And uh, in the acetylene market, we're about 20 to 30 percent less expensive. It's a $5 billion market. We are cleaner, cheaper, greener, and uh, safer than any gas to our knowledge in that industry and we're really starting to make a lot of traction with uh, end users such as demolition companies, scrap yards. Uh, and even GM, right? Even You're trying GM. to get out to yeah. use it in cars, right? Yeah. How is that going? Because you, your revenues are still uh, on, on the, the low side. Yep. Uh, still growing. We, well, we uh, have just really launched the market in November of 2011. So I would say we're at this less than a year. And in that year, we've um, made great strides into the industry with General Motors, for example, um, testing our gas as, as a replacement to acetylene in one of their facilities. Uh, we're in testing with the U.S. Navy. We have some major companies that are using our gas. Uh, One Steel is a multi-billion dollar company that's using it, all as a replacement to acetylene. So it's just... And know, who are some of your competitors in the market right now? The competitors in the market really are the other gases such as acetylene, propane, uh, in the industrial gas arena. And those are mostly sold by large companies such as Air Gas, uh, Air Liquide, some of those companies. And what's it going to take to get Magna Gas to the next level? You know, right now your revenues are around a uh, million dollars. So mm -hmm. what's it going to take to get to really take it to the next level? Well, sure. We just completed three capital raises, uh, so we're sufficiently capitalized now to bring the technology forward. Our plan is by this time next year to have six to eight refineries operating at various locations throughout the United States. We sell gas to uh, the end users, own and operate the refinery ourselves, and we're just going to grow organically from there. We're having huge feedback, great positive feedback from all of our customers that they've been waiting 80 years for a gas like this in this industry. So that's really our focus right now. And then our next focus is some of the other verticals that we have available to us, like replacement of hydrogen, um, you know, processing bio waste. There's all sorts of other markets we can go after, but right now we're focused on the acetylene replacement market.